Hello everybody, it is time for episode four of the most forgotten and rarest kid shows. Now, as you, a lot of you may know, I did not upload last week. We've had a bit of an issue with the neighbourhoods. Obviously not from my side, from where I live, obviously the other side. They've um, terrorised a lot of our gardens actually. They've um, stolen like a few figurines that we had from my nephew's garden. Um, they've even broken benches and all sorts of things in our garden so we've been complaining a lot of the neighbours on our side have been complaining as well it's been very stressful and I thought right let's not do a video and because it was just too much right now so I thought you know what I'll definitely come back so I'm back again today and I cannot wait to tell you guys all about what today's show is going to be about. It came a massive hit during the 90s. It started off from 1990 all the way till 2001 and it ended when I was just six years old. Now this show became such a classic hit, the best 90s show ever. So let's have a look at the introduction. And Rosie and Jim, oh my god, one of my most absolute favourites. I have so many episodes that I love and I obviously enjoyed. Now, this show became such a massive hit again. I think it was um, shown on like every Saturday mornings again, but best of all, they even came on like VHS tapes, they even had toys, they even had like real rag dolls of Rosie and Jim and it was just amazing. I even had an Explorer doll, nope it wasn't Dora the Explorer, um, but she definitely looked like a Rosie so I decided to call her that. Now I absolutely love this show, absolute best part of my childhood. This show also kind of brings back a bit of a sad memory for me because a lot of you may know, when I was about two years old, I was hospitalised because I had an ulcer in my mouth and it was very badly infected. And when I was in the hospital, I watched that show all the time on, on also like a big TV that we used to have back when we was in primary school. So I used to watch that like one time a day. So, yeah. So, my most favouritest episode, which was definitely the most hilarious and funniest one, Ew who was the last presenter who um, did the rag doll, who I just like drove the rag doll boat. And when he goes water skiing, you know, I remember when I, when I was little, I remember seeing it at a library, the VHS tape at a library. What we always did is that we always bought it from the library. Now that was always annoying because I knew I had to give it back. It's like being in Blockbusters again, but I never even went to Blockbuster. I always went to the library because it was, because it's still like near my town. I remember like watching it the first time and I could not stop laughing and when I had to give it back I was really like ashamed and a bit disappointed because I knew I'd never see it again but I went back again and saw it again I was like mommy I want it mommy please 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 I want it and she was very happy to buy it again I remember seeing that episode again when I was about 16 obviously on YouTube I suddenly started thinking why did I laugh at this episode so much? Looking back on it now, oh my god, now I know why. <laughs> you kind of see a bit of a difference like you see Rosie and Jim they're, they're on the skin they've got their close-ups but the next scene that you see them Rosie's hair looks so different and she's not even wearing a ribbon that is what made me laugh I don't know why but it was just hilarious because it's like you can hear them panicking but they're apparently just like holding each other and they're not doing anything not like moving about and I think that's what made me laugh so much because I mean how weird is that now another thing that made me laugh was when Neil was obviously like water skiing and as he was about to fall off, the man who was pulling the string 
literally just like, like, wait, whoa. And I don't know why, but that, that made me laugh because it's like, he's just fallen in the water and he's like saying, whoa. And he must have been under there for quite a long time. Like he probably like missed him going, whoa, okay. Oh, no, oh, okay. Boy, that must have hurt. <laughs> as much as I would have loved to be on a boat and obviously have a look at the ragdoll boat. One, I have a fear of water. And two, I mean, the fact that it's probably on like a lake or it must have been on a river, I think I would have been all right with that. But then again, you never know like how deep it is. I mean, with like the ocean, yeah, about 30,000 or like 100,000 feet deep. So that is scary stuff. Another episode I remember seeing, and when I first saw this, I was a little bit confused, but I absolutely loved it. But I have to admit, I find that this thing a little bit embarrassing. As much as it's very weird, I absolutely love it. I remember like dancing to it and like smiling at it and it was just great. I loved the, the part when like Rosie and Jim, they kept on like poking their heads out, like looking at each other. That always like made me laugh. It was so funny.